I have to be careful with deodorant because one time I was testing some deodorant for a brand and thought I was doing A-OK -okay and the car was like, you musty. You are musty. Hey guys, before we go any further, you have to hear from our sponsor over at Equa. I always say, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, so I'm just going to put it right here so you guys can see it. Valentine's Day is approaching, guys. You need to get your orders in so you can be cute in your red, pink, whatever you want to do for Valentine's Day. So let me show you guys some pieces from them. You guys know this is my favorite sleepwear, loungewear, lingerie company, period. The quality is unmatched. The pieces are duo, which means I can wear them to sleep. I can put on some heels and wear them out. Not all of them, but most of them. So that's the pieces I gravitate towards over here. I always link them right below the video. And so I'm going to show you three red pieces, of course, because of the occasion. You guys already know I love this company. I adore this company. And if you don't, you do now. Okay, so this is the first piece right here. Super cute short set. So this is a two-piece. It's satin, of course. It's red. It's trimmed in black. There's a pocket right here, which is good because y'all know I always like to put my phone somewhere they're supposed to be. The shorts are very comfortable. They're very stretchy. The drawstring does work on them. Believe it or not, a lot of the times that string is functional, non-functional on uh, um, clothes. The back, the back is pretty plain. It's really comfortable so let me come in again so you guys can see all the details boom black trimming on the sleeve as well as the shorts so this is cute and comfy so let's move into the next piece okay so i know you guys might be thinking sexy lingerie and etc for valentine's day but we do have some occasions where you don't need to do all that you do have that uh you do have galentines where you might want to be in a room with all your homegirls and y'all have matching pjs you might have like a day out with couples at a cabin and you don't want to walk around too revealing because there are other couples there um you might have you might want to cook for your boo and don't want to cook in sorry guys and don't want to cook in like a negligee and risk burning yourself or something like that so these are cute oh this quality oh this feels so good and i watch these pieces over and over and over and never have a problem out of them so this is it right here it's long sleeve it buttons it's very loose form fitting um very comfortable piece has a collar you can get a little risque if you want. If not, that's okay too. That's what the back look like. Girl, this is cute. And of course, <laughs> y'all know I'm going to have to do it to y'all. Let me give me a little. If you want to put some gold heels on. You can wear it out. You got your outfit. Put you some gold heels on, a purse, and rock out. <laughs> Super cute. So, who hey, sexy red. <laughs> this is sleepwear, guys. Yeah, so imagine walking out in this and then taking it off. But, of course, it can double as a dress as well. We're going to take that same purse. Maybe that's too much red on red, huh? But y'all get what I'm trying to do, what I'm trying to say. Perfect, perfect. I absolutely love their pieces. As always, I will make sure I link all of these pieces below. Thank you so much for sponsoring this video. And let's move into the blog. So y'all, it's your little auntie, the one that little dress act too young for her age, but I'm still real, real lit. Proven fact. Okay, so let's just hop straight into it. Alright guys, this is kind of going to be a little fast forward because I've already been doing the vlog, um, but I had to do my sponsorship. So I am going to show you guys some packages, right? I'm going to do a try on per use, then I'm going to go into the vlog clip. Mm -mm. Then I'm going to go into the vlog clips and then I'm going to come back 
and you guys will see me back like this just just hop on for the ride okay y'all gonna get this work though let's go hey guys now that the hair review is done <laughs> i love it like this i'm gonna take my light and take my pictures that i sent over to the company and i just use this light that i got from amazon i will link it below i think we all have this light at this point get you a backup girl because they bum I literally clip it to my phone so I can get the best lighting possible. I sit my phone on my vanity. Uh, ooh, ooh, be careful though. And then I set a timer so that I can do my own pictures. Three seconds is enough for me to get my pose right. Ooh, ooh it wasn't that time. <laughs> Fix yourself before you hit the button. These are Mahi Collection earrings. I'm like obsessed with Mahi Collection. How can you not be obsessed? Because Pretty Brie is like the fashion girl for black girl luxury in general. And her pieces just exemplifies that. So let's go on a spree. This light as well be giving them pictures that extra um. Just look at me on camera without it. Dead. Watch this. Alive. <laughs> We're gonna start with Laura Mercier. Everything I show you will be linked below, babies. Oh, not hi Nikki. <laughs> hey girl. <laughs> yes okay this is their petite le petite secret is out the viral laura mercier foundation is available in a concealer new real flawless weightless perfect perfecting concealer why the heck can i talk okay so here's a little promo for it baby don't say little don't put nothing little in front of laura mercier and i ain't playing my skin is finally starting to act right. Y'all ready for me to get back on the makeup channel? Because where I been? Okay. So they sent me over three shades. They sent over four in two. Oh, I'm going to just put them like this so you guys can see them. I'm not going to even take them out the box to swatch them or anything. We're going to carry this over on to TikTok in the makeup channel. So highlight, regular shade, and a contour shade. Y'all know I don't really play about Laura Mercier, so I already know these are going to be great. I can feel it in my spirit. <laughs> Shea Moisture. I have, have I ever got anything from them? Ooh, they got a deodorant. Living in my rich melanin and protecting it too. This is the first ever antiperspirant Dio range deodorant. So, you know, I have to really look into this deodorant because I don't play about my deodorants, y'all. You can't have no parabens, aluminums, none of that in them, okay? So, let's see what it say. 48 hours. 48 hours. Yeah, I be I have to be careful with deodorant because one time I was testing some deodorant for a brand and thought I was doing A-OK -okay and the car was like, you musty. You are musty. So, <laughs> Let me stop, let me stop. Shade Dio for us. So they sent over, oops, they sent over two, no parabens, no mineral oils. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Raw shea butter and hyaluronic acid and coconut hibiscus. Baby, I love me some deodorant. Because, <laughs> baby, ain't nobody finna be musty. Here's the, here's the hack. Y'all look, listen to platinum. Turn it, turn it. Turn it and pop it off. Ooh! This is the raw shea butter one. That smells so freaking good. Oh my gosh. And let's see what this one here now. I can't even get the top off. My God. Mmm! Nicole would love this. Nicole would love coconut. This is bomb. Both of them smell absolutely amazing. This smells like pina colada. But y'all let until test them out. And y'all will hear about it throughout vlogs. But as far as the way they smell, 
absolutely amazing. I would really like both of those smells and a perfume. So I wasn't gonna mention them because I am about to record a perfume video, but Dossier sent me over some new goodies and they will be sponsoring that video. Dossier said we want y'all you we want you two times this month. Girl, you showing out. And, and I'm gonna deliver. So I'm gonna show y'all what I got, but I'm gonna go in depth over on the perfume video. So check that out too. It might be up first. They sent over two perfumes. One is their inspiration of Love Don't Be Shy and one is their inspiration of Baccarat, of course. They sent over this candle. Maybe when I reviewed Dossier candles, they didn't look like this or smell like this. We'll talk, oh, we'll talk about it over on other channel. And they sent me over another diffuser because you guys know I'm obsessed with those. So I will look, so I will leave my Dossier code below along with my link. Check that out and check out that other video. Speaking of that, when I was telling you guys about Nicole leaving about two vlogs ago. If you don't know about Nicole leaving, you need to catch up. We're about on our fourth vlog. It's a blog that says she moved out. Then I went to Cancun for Christmas by myself. It's a question and answer and it's another vlog. Y'all got to catch up. A lot of y'all saying a whole bunch of stuff I said in them vlogs. All right. In one of them vlogs, I was talking about Dossier and I was like, I don't even have Baccarat. And I said, let me order it right now. And she did the big boy I, i'm just learning if it's the if i want to treat myself do it and i'm gonna use the heck out of it anyway so why about a little bottle i have to keep replacing a little bottle play so i got the 6.7 fluid ounce dang that's a lot you know i had got this ounce in the um gentle fluidy gold as well miss baccarat can't miss baccarat is that girl when i first got baccarat which is a oh where's my phone Where's my phone? I'm gonna prove it. So I really went and got my phone because I was look. I look at my Facebook memories every night to see like memories of my son and stuff. And this say peer pressure made me do it. This is January 19, 2021. Peer pressure made me do it. I don't think I'm happy with Miss Baccarat. Let me give her a test drive today. And it was my first time ever purchasing Baccarat. Now look at me. Now look at me. This is my second time buying Baccarat. I got the, the hair mist. <laughs> I got the lotion, the hand wash shower gel, the sparkling oil, and I had the regular oil, but I sold it. That's why you got to give some things, people, companies, relatives a chance. You're not going to always get it the first time or like it the first time or understand the first time. <sighs> like that was literally how many years ago today? Three? That was 2021. Three years ago today and now I'm just in love with it. It's just universal. I, I get so many compliments when I wear that. And, and <sighs> oh, I can cut up now. <laughs> but I ain't got time. Let's keep going. Okay, if you guys pay attention here on the community tab, Instagram, Snapchat, my Facebook, follow all of them. It's the link below with all of my socials. I told y'all that these shoes went on sale for $50, originally $200. And I usually take stuff out the box before I show y'all, but I didn't with this because I want Nordstrom's to see how you package stuff. If you work for Nordstrom, this is Tax Fit. <laughs> There was plenty of tissue paper, a receipt, some free gifts, you know. I kid you not, I put this on everything I love. Nordstrom's will throw your stuff in a box. If it's a perfume, they'll put it in a sandwich bag. A sandwich bag. Whew. These are Tory Burch. They sent that big box because I got me in a sugar pear. And they're the jellies. Y'all know I'm not a pink girl, but $50. $50. I find something to wear with them. And they look like this. Just some jellies. I just posted some bum MCM shades that were on sale. So y'all gotta follow them tab stuff so you'll know when those deals go. Because once they're posted, mm -mm. I did fall for the t-shirt trend that's going on. I saw Glimmer's on tan one and people buy these for their man or their woman to wear, but cause I love myself, I buy myself one. <laughs> it just has your name 
and you can add the picture so of course I tried to go with purple pictures to make it purple and child I bought it for myself but the coat to my she still want it I get a one for Valentine's Day because that's my shirt <laughs> I don't know what to tell you so now I'm gonna move it to Shein this stuff is not sponsored but I am gonna show you some clothes that is I'm sorry they just be sponsoring every video if you're tired of them I don't know what to tell you <laughs> So first, I got sunglasses. Whew. Am I excited about these? Let me just zoom in a little closer. And I'm gonna tell y'all what makes the part this, this so magnificent. None of these shades was over $5. Amazon who? <laughs> I honestly think I got these. They probably another shade. Cause y'all can play with somebody else. Auntie, not this lit one. <laughs> what what was say? Who got something to say? Y'all still playing? Oh yeah. I think I'm gonna do a reel on these. And what about it? These are damn fly and different. Just purge my shades, y'all. I just be doing stuff in. And who? I needed a white pair of shades, so why not? I look meh. Mm. Come on, Sheen. I got a code. It'll be below. Last but not least. Girl, I should just leave these on the rest of the video. And I got some press on toenails. Y'all know I don't play, play about my Sheen press on nails, my Sheen press on toenails. And don't. I'm going to take these off because I don't want that indention. Messing up my beautiful five minute makeup. <laughs> I ran out of toenails, so I got I stacked up on me some. French tip with some bling. All white. This all white got some holographic glitter in it though. Regular French tips. Should hate these, but blinged out metallic. <laughs> Regular blinged out. More Frenchies with a different bling. More Frenchies with a different bling. Bling. I need to do my toes right now, honestly. And a white pair. Let's move into the clothes. But hold on, get this beat. <laughs> Alright, guys. So this Shein haul is going to be a little bit grown and sexy, okay? It's not the typical stuff you'll see from me, but... I need some grown and sexy pieces, right? So this piece right here was inspired by another website that's very popular right now. It's very plain Jane. They are very expensive. I'm not going to mention them, but it gives a look. So this is the full look right here. It's giving very much modern girl. Giving funeral for me a little bit, but it's a cute dress. Very, very cute. Y'all know I'll make it work. Let's put it on. I'm going to put it on for y'all. So this one here gives me the same exact feel. It's velvet though, and it has and it has like tie stra it has tie straps up here. And that's what you have right there. Cute pumps, a cute hat or something, and you're out the door. Woo! Hey, look, honey. Let me step on back, girl. This is giving pretty woman after the whole stage <laughs> okay playing at the back y'all this is so cute like where i'm gonna wear this to we'll figure it out but i love this the quality is amazing as well come on she let's do that this is really cute 
Cause nah, for real. Look out until y'all let auntie. <laughs> Baby. I don't have the right garments on today. But with me smoothed the hell out. Then I got on some, but they ain't the ones that be smoothing me. Child, this is too cute. Tell me it ain't. Tell me it ain't. Child. Mm hmm. Got us some house tooth, very flowy. <laughs> Cut my head off a little bit, but y'all see the drip. Follow the drip. Mm-hmm. This is a one piece. It looks like a dress with a shirt over it, but it's a one piece. Okay, we got this cute little number. It's black and cream. Just something really simple to just throw on. I would throw on a number of things to dress it up, but it's just a plain. It's plain at the back though. It's a cute dress. Really, really cute. This one stay sold out, so I guess I'm not the only person that think it's cute. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It was cute on the website. I'm not even sure I got the dress on right. I put a bitch up. Because something got to be wrong. Because what, you know. But it got potential. I mess around and kill this. I just got to put my thought to it. And look on the website to see how I'm supposed to have this on. Um, it's really, really cute. This belt is detachable. Yeah. Honey, when I say quality, this is so thick, it don't even feel like it came from Shein. It is the quality. It's just a plain house to dress, though. I would put a white button-up shirt under here or a black bodysuit. Has two pockets right here. It's really thick. It's really, really thick. Great quality, guys. And last, hear me out, hear me out. Of course, I would not wear this like this, okay? So what you're gonna be getting is this like skater skirt type vibe with the suspender type vibes. Of course, a white shirt under here, an all black shirt under here. This t-shirt was near and dear, so I just put it on to show you guys because I couldn't come on here with just a bra, right? So really, really cute. That's how the back look, if I got it on right yet. It's real cute. Just imagine it with like an all black shirt, all white shirt. I kind of played y'all with this rainbow shirt, but that's it. So that's all the shin pieces. I will link them below along with a discount code. Tell me your favorite piece in the bottom. I think my favorite one was that black and red dress. That, that pretty woman coming down the street with my shopping bags. What was it? <laughs> Hey y'all, it's your little auntie, the one that looks dressed act too young for her age. But I'm still real, real lit, honey. Let me tell y'all something. I don't know who in their right mind thought it was a great idea to schedule me for a 7.45 a.m. doctor's appointment. And it's 18 degrees outside. Uh -oh, I don't even know. I don't even know. I know my doctor's super hard to get in. So maybe when I was there the last time and they was making my appointments, they was like, this all we got. And my dumb was like, okay. Because who ain't no morning person? I already know I'm going to get fussed at because I'm supposed to be losing weight and gaining the pound since the last time I've been to the doctor. I, I just got off the scale and then I'm going to weigh more at the doctor because... Now I'm fully dressed in jeans, Ugg boots and stuff because it's 18 degrees. You know, I'm going to say it's her fault. She the one had me on them damn steroids. Oh, actually she did. My physical therapist did from the car wreck. So, yeah. Let's just go. I'm telling y'all right now, I got to meet somebody with this wig. This the wig I wore in, um, oh, this mother pretty Cancun why am I giving somebody this I'm giving it to them for their birthday should have watched it last night cause y'all know I went to the beach the pool a minutes we went through some things so should have watched it 
let's just go so guys i got a little bit more time because my doctor is fairly close like a little bit like five minutes so usually what i do is show y'all my perfume tray from the previous week but i'm just going to insert that clip right here oh um clive christian crab apple blossom still on here say noir by beyonce it's still on here which i did take with me to houston so maybe i should take that off because i took the little one and it did its thing it did its thing and this is another dossier golden rum and amber it sort of kind of smells like gentle fluidy go that's what that look like this is talia by tiziana terenzi and I'm gonna add Miss Girl by Oksha. Love this. Oh my gosh. It smells like Baccarat and Tom Ford Lost Cherry Mix. And I'm gonna add Grand Sword. This has been going viral on TikTok and I got it. But y'all, you, you can have stuff and not understand the hype behind it. Does that make sense? So I'm gonna try to see if I can get to the hype behind it. I mean, I like it, but girl, TikTok is making it seem like it's so good. Now that I have that out the way, I have took some days off. But I've been cleaning. I got a whole bunch of stuff to show y'all, which I might show y'all later on today or tomorrow. You know, it don't matter because tomorrow, guess where we go? To the OBGYN. It's the beginning of the year. These appointments stack, y'all. I got the eye doctor, the OBGYN, physical therapy regular annual exam with my primary but let me just show y'all that the point of me bringing up the perfume was i had time on my hands so i cleaned up my perfume look so i just straightened them and made them look neater categorized them did have a sale most likely all of them are sold out i literally went through I um, washed the glass and all that, which I didn't do a great job because I need to go get Windex. And yeah, yeah, I get my true. So once again, this is last vlog's tray. I'll rebuild a new one when we get back because, baby, I got to go. I want to fight everybody in the United States of America because this don't make no sense. Well, it ain't too bad. My car says 20. Check washer fluid, baby. I bet it's probably froze. Oh, let's go. Well, is your map covered? 8.24. Why is her hat? My appointment was at 8 o'clock. Is my doctor even here? Did you sleep in? It's a note on the door that say, if you have been waiting in this lobby more than 10 minutes for an appointment, please let the front desk know. I'm about to get the fuck up. What I look like. Besides some porn. Y'all, please pray for me. Y'all know I hate this store now. Well, going in it. But I have to get boxes to ship y'all perfume and Amazon to my two days from now. Uh uh. Don't have Apple Pay. Well, looky, looky. All right, perfumes are boxed up. I have three more if they don't sell by the time I go to the post office. I'm keeping them. All right, honey. So let's talk about this tray. Basically, what I did was pulled all the purple perfumes out of one tower. Not both of my towers, just one. So this is Gucci Floral Gorgeous Magnolia. Beautiful scent. Just don't last too long. This is Juice Box. Feather Supreme. I'm going to give this another try. This is Versace Dylan Purple. This is an Amazon scent called Jasmine Whist that I absolutely adore. I get so many compliments every time I wear that. And both, girl, both of these are Montal. This is Sensual Instinct. And this one right here is Intense Cafe. Alright y'all, so I just got out the shower. I thought I was gonna run to the post box, P.O. What is the dang thing called? Post office today, but I'ma just try to see if these last three sell and I just drop them in the morning and I got a lot of work to do tomorrow, so I just do all my work tomorrow. 
I'm going to put on Gucci Floral Gorgeous Magnolia. So let me break this down for you real quick. It's a very gorgeous scent. Just like the name say, it just don't last that long. And this is really light and airy. So it's great to like wear to bed. Hold on, because y'all trying to see my business. <laughs> it's great to wear to bed. You know, something like that. has a nice little smell to it to me so if i was to have to rate that i would give it about a strong seven yeah i give it about a seven so what i'm about to do is attempt to take a nap because i got up at like seven something to get to the doctor and y'all let us don't be getting up to like 12. <laughs> it depends like i can't constant sleep so some days i wake up at nine then I go back to sleep, get back up at 12. Some days I get up at 5, stay up for 4 hours, and go back at 9. My sleep patterns and stuff are so off. They've been like that ever since I've been dealing with grief, menopause, and all that. So, maybe I just get to sleep when I can. I'm going to sit over and scroll in this phone, watch I don't get no sleep. Yeah, it is seriously hours later. <sighs> yeah, I got the big heater on. Mm-mm. I got my room heater on, but I got a fan going right here. It's, it's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. But um, I just wanted to come on camera because I love y'all so, so, so much. So, so, so much. You guys, especially like the ones who are therapists and stuff, and you guys, uh, I'm trying not to cry. Y'all know what I'm saying. You guys are helping me navigate through this, like, all I want to be able to do, I'm going I, I, to explain this to y'all because somebody needs to hear it. All I've ever wanted to be able to do is understand my situation. And I can't understand my situation because I've never dealt with it. So what I'm trying to say about that is like in my family, when people got low, we say go pray go to church we get together as a family we help out it's like when a pandemic hit we all hit different stores and split the meat we really close we if i'm feeling low my auntie and them will come over here and lay in the bed with me type stuff so i never had to deal with mental illness or nothing so I really want to understand it because I know when I get low, like especially right when my son died and et cetera, I don't want nobody to feel like that, especially every day and they can't control it. So I've, I want I want to understand mental illness. I want to help Nicole still because I can't imagine. I sat over here a whole month straight in the bed almost. I didn't even know the days I had showered when my son died and etc. That is a very low place and to involuntarily feel just feel like that because of chemical imbalance i can't imagine it i can't so said i let to say woo, because y'all know i i rarely cry on camera that um it's a lot of you guys that are therapists and stuff and you're helping me understand this a whole lot better it's a lot of you guys who aren't therapists who just who you you suffer from mental illness or deal with somebody a child or spouse or something y'all are helping me a great deal oh my gosh i just never ever 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 knew and i just wish i would have known because it would have stopped so much animosity and unnecessary drama within my house if my babe would have just opened up my ex babe would have just opened up and told me, Look, I feel like this. Anyway, let's hop off of that because, baby, whew, that's gonna take me there. Um, I also want to tell you guys, you know, like if you 
want to do anything if you into influence or influencing or anything like that um this let your race be your race i'm saying that because a lot of good things have happened to me lately you guys will start sending them on camera i talked briefly about a couple of them in my last vlog and it's been a whole bunch of times i don't know i almost gave up right um i know i get picked on um a lot because I'm not in the newest this and the newest this and people think because I'm not I don't have it but there's a couple of factors to that for one I'm from the hood Oak Cliff to be exact if you know anything about Dallas Texas okay um so I don't I'm, I'm not flashy because where I'm from you flashy and what happened so I don't try to be if I want to treat myself or something but I still like to remain low key because because I look at some YouTubers on here and I'm like you telling all your business and if I know that area I know where you be and I can know where you stay and I know what you drive and I know what you and y'all just be and it, it just be a lot so i still think with that oak cliff mind frame i'm protecting me i'm protecting my family it's like somebody knocked on the door today to try to sell something and my daddy was talking to him and i instantly got up strapped like because i've been seeing too much stuff on instagram like pretending to talk to people at the door and then people bum rush them and invade their house like i probably scared the sh out of that man because i was like why you ask my daddy all these questions why you at my door we don't need nothing and he was like and I didn't feel bad because why are you still going around door to door right now? That is so dangerous. People are crazy. It's me. Um, but I do. Uh, that's one of the factors. And then another factor is getting money is not new to me. I'm not the richest and I've never been the richest, but I've always been a hustler. Whether it was a good hustler or a bad hustler, I've always got whatever I wanted, whether a man bought it a female bought it i always can't nobody can't i wish somebody would say i'm lying <laughs> um always i was 21 in lexus's i was 23 with a range rover so like just because i got money now i don't think to just go out and get that because i've i've had it <laughs> i've had it so I also and and the third reason is I don't feel like I have to spend my money to impress other people. I know a lot of people say when I buy stuff I ain't it's for me it's for me. Child have that stuff y'all. Oh. I ain't gonna go there. But is it really? You get what I'm saying? That's why it's called a trend. That's why it's called influencing. Like a lot of people don't even think to get stuff until they see other people with it. You get what I'm saying? I'm not I'm not I'm not easily influenced. I'm sorry. Another thing you guys have been asking me, I've been outside and a lot of guys you guys have been asking me why I haven't connected with YouTubers or subscribers or nothing. Y'all, my mind is just on me right now. I, I can't be hooking up with so and so in in Las Vegas because that night I might have a moment like I just had and don't want to go nowhere so here I am in Las Vegas and y'all like Nikki acting weird yeah because I'm doing what it I can do I'm doing what it takes to get by and be healthy and better right now it might look like I'm partying and having a bunch of fun but I, I'm still struggling I'm at peace I'm happier I'm not as irritable I'm not as cranky I'm not as stressed so my health feel is better my mood is better but I'm still struggling y'all like I am still struggling and I still worry about Nicole 60 70 percent of the day so said I hold that to say because that was eight minutes and 15 seconds love y'all I, I really really do I really really do I really really do I, a lot of you guys are saying y'all see a different side of me and yeah y'all I was grieving going through menopause fighting parasites helping my dad with cancer yeah I, I turned into a bitch 
A lot of you guys wouldn't even be able to handle all that I went through. So it makes me wish I would have just stopped vlogging. <laughs> I wish I would have just stopped vlogging. Because a lot of them videos I even want to delete. I ain't gonna even lie. I wish I would have just stopped vlogging. But I couldn't. <laughs> I couldn't. I had to keep the income fluent so I didn't lose everything I had worked for. <sighs> Yeah, so I, I I I didn't have no full I didn't I I didn't have no spouse that say hey I got you till I didn't have no I it's me I'm the top dog around here and I ain't I ain't somebody to call I'm in general so I hope from here on out all my vlogs bring y'all joy. It's so many of you guys. If y'all look at the comments in my last video, it was so many people saying, Oh, you just popped back up in my feed. Oh, I thought you stopped doing videos. Been trying to tell y'all. I've been shadow banned for the longest. And then some people will talk smart and be like, Well, you still come up in my feed. Yeah. You're probably one of my newest subscribers or you probably watch frequently. Anybody else? I don't be coming up. I ain't got to lie about that, baby. I hear them in my comments all the time. Oh, I thought you, girl, where you been? Oh, I thought you had stopped recording. It's the weirdest shit ever, cuz. With that being said, hit subscribe and hit the bell so you'll know when I load a video. That's a big thing because one lady was like, I just had your um, channel saved in my browser and would just refresh every day to see if you loaded a new video. No, just subscribe and hit the bell. <laughs> but anyway, we had 10 minutes. Oh. Girl, y'all almost seen my vagina. <laughs> we at 10 minutes and 34, 45 seconds now. Tomorrow, we're going to the post office. I got to get y'all stuff out. Everything sold except the Too Faced, so I raffled it. And I ain't trying to get rich. So, I stopped the raffle. The Too Faced um, perfume was $100 and some dollars. I'm going to stop the raffle when I get my money back for it. I ain't just going to let it just run. I ain't trying to say no get rich quick. Um, I gotta go pick up some stuff for Wild Grace because now <laughs> Ooh, I'm gonna break that free all over again. I gotta buy paper towels, uh, tissue, dishwasher detergent. I gotta buy all that. I mean, I used to buy it, but she used to help. She used to help. <laughs> I'm a strong black woman though, so this her right now. Little tug bug. Oh, said so she just hurt her shoulder. Let me call her, y'all. Bye. Oh, oh, Nicole said she want to do a question and answer. I don't know how we going to do it. God dang, FaceTime. She said she want to answer y'all questions because, I don't know, I guess she just want to answer y'all questions. I don't know about that, though, because y'all know, I don't know. I'm just, just stay out of my channel. No, because somebody going to say the wrong thing, and I'm going to be like, Nah. Oh, and I gotta go to the OBGYN tomorrow. Yeah, on the real. Yeah, I already told y'all. I be wanting to scroll up with my OBGYN. And I'm gonna make this real quick because I just talked y'all ear out. He played too much in my vagina. I'm dead serious when I say that. And, and y'all go laugh because y'all think I'm borderline a comedian. But when you down there, I don't need all that plan, bro. I don't need all that plan. He play too dang much. Like the last time he doing a whole pap smear. And he want to talk about a pretty woman to play. And I'm going to come, talk about some, come with me and my wife and cracking jokes and stuff. Boy, if you don't get that scalp, whatever that thing, you scrap. Then my blood pressure was up last time I went because he had me waiting an hour in the lobby. And he was like, what's the issue? I'm like, I got white coat syndrome. Anytime I step in any kind of doctor's office, my blood pressure going to be high. You got to wait a few minutes and take it again. I don't even have on a white coat. That's what he going to say. But play with somebody else, mama, not Chooks. Not Myers. All right, guys. So it's hours later. Oh, I do still smell it. Very faintly. Very, very faintly. You gotta do all this. Mm -mm. Like I said, gorgeous magnolia. Gorgeous gardenia magnolia. Is that what it's called? 
great scent, but you have to put that baby in your purse and reapply. What Fumi say? She here for a good time, not a long time. Well, hi there. Off to get played with, literally. Mm -hmm. Let's go with... Jasmine Whist. Somebody tell me to quit turning the bottle sideways like that and make y'all have to turn y'all phone or something sideways. I don't understand that concept, but just know anything I use, talk about, go... It's always in the description box, y'all. My last vlog, a lot of guys, you guys kept asking me about Miss Girl. It was in the description box. Uh, Joy, because I said it smelled like Beyonce, say Noir, in the description box. I do forget sometimes to add it, and I'll go back and add it, but please check the description. It smells so good. It's so fruity. This is really fruity. It used to be like $25. Hmm. Now it's like 60 It's but it's still good on Amazon. One of my top, this, the Siage. Mm, the Siage on this and the Lasting Power. Tell y'all all the time. If if you follow me, you about tired of hearing this story, ain't you? You like platinum, let it go. But a man chased me off a cruise. Y'all saw it. Like I was smelling it in the wind the whole cruise. And it was me. But it ain't loud and obnoxious. Let me go. I had to come back real quick. Listen to Auntie Platt and listen to me good. I don't steer you in the wrong direction. That's why I got a vaginal hygiene video with almost two, three million views. I don't remember where it's at now. Anytime, anytime in a gynecologist, massage therapist, estheticianist, go thank me for this. Anytime you are going to get a wax, a massage, a checkup, have sex, shower. Shower. <laughs> Don't nobody want you. I ain't finna start. Shower. Let me tell y'all something. You want to piss me off? V-Tex as well. My God. Oh, hey, FedEx. And it's literally for me. <laughs> literally. Y'all, oh child, yeah, ma'am, ma'am, yes, ma'am. I done lost two pounds already. I told y'all I can lose 10 pounds in a week. I just gotta stop eating so much. Let me just go and wait on him. <sighs> Baby, I'm about to die. Actually, he need to come on because I got, oh, I got time. Y'all, let me tell y'all the best thing on the planet. Curbside pickup, baby. I ordered all that tissue and stuff last night. <laughs> oh, cause, cause y'all know about the blanket. I thought somebody was flirting. Okay, so uh, I ordered all this tissue and stuff last night, baby. She came out in three minutes. Now, let's get this package to the post office. All right, guys. You can't see me. All my errands are ran. Um. I actually, instead of just dumping them packages, I took them in there so they can scan them, so they can go ahead and move in the system. So I don't have to worry about a lot of people writing me, asking about their tracking information. That's just a hack. When you ship from home or a warehouse like I do, <coughs> a lot of people be, my packages are moving, my tracking, da 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 da. Because sometimes you can print the label and it'll be sitting at home, the warehouse, or to be sitting up here in a box go ahead and tell a person to check scan it in so it can say it was brought to the post office you get what i'm saying hey, if i want it i don't ask no price yeah. okay look at where in the call it oh hell no we cleared up in one day y'all we already i'm about to find out i got some cowboy boots on baby i'm gonna go put on some slides i got liquid leggings on Texas. I, I think I need to clean my camera lens. That definitely matters when you're recording. Baby, it matters a whole lot. Clean them lenses. You'll be supply, surprised the clarity after you clean your lens. But, um, I got indigestion so bad, y'all. It's all my fault. I be telling y'all in my big grown age, I like to define nature. <laughs> Is that nature? No, I like to define whatever. 
and I had oh and I'm gonna go get some more sugar my, yeah my baby if she wasn't doing her I would get her a cooking truck I am not playing but anyway she made some grilled fish last night with broccoli and then she put the grilled fish on a bed of cauliflower rice Anybody who know me know broccoli and cauliflower gives me indigestion. I don't know what it is. I love broccoli. It is actually my favorite vegetable. But it's hard for me to eat. It's so hard for me to eat. Man. And one more thing while I'm educating the people. Let's just go back to the last topic. Don't forget to wash your ass either. Your back. So anyway, doctor's offices. Stop telling me. Unless you that doctor's office that's on your ish. Stop telling me to be here 15 minutes early. You still ain't gonna see me until 20 minutes after my appointment time. Why are you having me here early then? And my appointment at 8. You tell me to be here at 745 so you can get my insurance, ID, all of that. Why is it 8 40? I'm still waiting in the lobby. I got a job too. I got things to do too. So stop telling me to be here early if you ain't go give me right on time for my appointment. Now, my doctor's office don't play with that. That's why yesterday I was shocked. Like, what is going on? But this man here, baby, just call me the timing pro because I did all of that and still 10 minutes early. Like, I do not play with people in their time. If I'm late, something is really going on. Really, really going on because I respect people. To, like, you want to aggravate me? Play my time. Play my time. Play my time. Play my time, bro. Play my... Because you know something? A lot of people like, play with my money. But money, I can make back. Time, I can't get that back. And time, when you play with my time, to me, it's like saying, F me. I don't care. I get there. I... That's selfish, bro. That is so selfish. Take me some shoes. And I learned that. And everybody be begging me to start doing makeup. Uh-uh. Because -uh. a lot of people wasn't taught right. And it's one thing to be late. Some happened. An accident. Traffic. I wasn't feeling good. But to just always be late. Because you wanted to do your makeup. Learn how to calculate your time right. Be, be responsible. Because, baby, let me tell you something. I will go on without you. Let me be waiting on something. They say you about to miss your reservation or something. And I, oop. If you get in, you just get in. As I'm getting out the car, it reminded me of what my OBGYN did that pissed me off the last time. It was right before Pretty Woman. And I was telling him I was going by myself. And he was like, he got a season pass to the theater and all that. And then he was like, you should go with me and my wife. Well, don't say nothing like that when you digging guts deep because I'm I think you want a threesome or something. Why why you why you say that right now? You should go with me and my wife. Why, you and your wife? Well, hold up, cause I guess he can't invite me by himself, right? Cause then it's cheating. N never mind. Y'all yeah, know what time? Oh, I'm ashy. Y'all yeah, know what time it is? I just want y'all to know I'm joking about my OBGYN. That's my boy. <laughs> he said he going to see Tina. I see you there. Oh. But um, he's saying that um, he's going to put me on semi-glide, whatever this stuff is that the Ozempic do. I asked for it though. <laughs> I'm trying to get skinty. But now, nah, um, I forgot what else I was going to tell y'all. I'll tell y'all in the car. All right, guys, next up, not today. I should have told him to do it. Get an HIV test. Anytime you're starting a new relationship or starting to date and stuff, I always go in with a clean slate. I mean, you should get them anyway, but 
Y'all get what I'm saying. Yeah, I walked in my room. It smelled too good. It's the aftermath of this. And let me tell y'all what else y'all need to go. Oh, it smells so good in here. Hold on. Let me tell y'all what else y'all need to go get. Every morning when I get up and make my bed and stuff now, because I do that now, I spray this from Bath and Body Work. Aromatherapy. This is the tea tree and peppermint. Man, my room smells good. The mixture of this and this is a minty, fruity. It smells so good. So, anyway. Watch your girl gonna get on Ozempic. He said, depending on my insurance, um, Ozempic, and if my insurance won't cover it, that Semaglide or Semaglade, I don't know how you say it. Nicole, y'all know Nicole Hayden. <laughs> You can't, you can't, uh, yeah, okay, whatever, Nicole, but, nah, we'll see, um, I got my favorite meal, my favorite healthy meal, but I ain't showing y'all, cause it be out of stock, and if I show y'all, I ain't gonna ever be able to get it, mm, I'll show y'all next block, <laughs> tell them it's what, baby, <laughs> <laughs> that bow is too good, Trying to tell y'all now we gotta tell Nicole. Why my phone look like this? And it ain't dirty. You probably got this thing on. What thing? That's better. I don't know how to work it. Hold up. Hold up. Nicole. Go ahead. Oh, that bowl too good. That bowl? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm talking to these things. Huh? Hey y'all, so it's late. I didn't do nothing. We're going to bed. I'm going to try out um, this juice box because I don't remember when I smoked it in the scent room and the owner gifted me a bottle. This is like the best one. Mmm, that is kind of good. Out of the ones I picked. But I really want a cheeky smell, y'all. This Feather Supreme inspired by Aretha Franklin. I'm going to see how this works while I go to bed. I mean... You get what I'm saying? I'm actually gonna clean up. That was so bad. Cause why did I get in the shower? Cause now I wanna clean my bathroom. I'm gonna get. I was supposed to do my hair today and do a video, but uh, I've been on the Facetime with Nicole all day because why? Oh, she snowed in and she bored. So, why not? I'll report back live on this. It's not one of them. Let's just put it like this. I like it, but if I run out of it, I wouldn't repurchase it. It's, it's good, but it's not like, ooh, I need this again. Does that make sense? Yeah, I just hopped up. I put the exact same thing I got on yesterday, but that's because I'm only going to be in it by... 20 minutes. She looks my she needed to be somewhere at one. But I hopped up. She can't be late. So I put the same shirt back on from yesterday. And it smells heavily of Jasmine Wisp still. This is so good, y'all. Oh, it smells so heavily on this shirt. A whole 24 hours later. That doesn't make any sense for it to be like an Amazon or Arabian brand or what not a raven or um what's the word i'm looking for middle eastern brand i don't even want to put nothing else on but i am <laughs> i'm gonna put oh this right here shocked me last night too once it's settled it's still on that gown too yeah that's pretty good too child now i'm just put a little splash of this on her this is Versace Dylan Purple. This is a soft, fruity smell. It's fruity, but it's airy. This smells damn good. I think this is my favorite Dylan. It has like a bubblegum like hint to it. That's my favorite Dylan. I just saw Dylan Turquoise. That wasn't me. I'm not into aquatic, sea, water. That's why I don't like Dolce & Cabana light blue. I'm not that type of girl. Um, 
Dylan Blue. It's like peachy, whatever. I ain't got much time. I ain't going to take the camera because I'm going to just take her to work. Drop this box. I auctioned out that auction. <laughs> raffled out that Too Faced. The person sent their address after I left the post office yesterday. So I'm going to take that to the post office real quick. And I'm going to come back and work. It's time for us to get cute. We've been looking dusty long enough. All right, guys. I am back. Um, child, I've done a lot. I've done the whole beginning of this vlog. I've done a chin try on. I've opened some packages. I've done my hair. Um a whole bunch of stuff and now we can resume on with the rest of this vlog i am about to put on something though and record a perfume video so i'm gonna put all these clothes up these are the clothes that i tried on at the beginning of the video i just put all that at the front to get it out the way and now i'm gonna record this perfume video and i'm gonna try to go out tonight and we got some things to do tomorrow too so let's go we're gonna record this perfume video. Y'all see how I did that? Y'all see how? I... <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Looking out. <laughs> I put in some work today, y'all. Yes. Indeed. All right, guys. So I'm actually on my way to meet one of you guys, Jennifer. You contacted me about three weeks ago. I was like, I'm gonna be here between this and this. Can I see you? And I was like, Sure. Just meet me. I mean, hit me when you get here, because y'all uh, you know my schedule and my lifestyle is hectic. So she's here. It's really cold. She's Ubering, so I don't want to say meet me here and build up her Uber bill. Well, I really could go and get her, and we could go eat or something. But um, I am swamped on work and I have a deadline in the morning. So I got to come back and edit and she's kind of far. And so I said, she asked, if it wasn't for y'all, I would be nothing. So I'm going to take her birthday gift in her hotel lobby. Yep. You going to see me somehow. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Let's put on a little sensual instinct. A bit more. Um, I'm taking her some. I'm. I let her disclose if she want to show y'all what she got, but she got some good gifts up in her chat. Y'all know. I just put on this shein dress and some thigh boots, honey. <laughs> Cause I ain't gonna be gone long. I really gotta come back home and work, guys. But I love y'all so much. I, I I gotta meet her. Child, I done made it to this hotel and I got a piece so bad. I, well, most hotel lobbies got a bathroom because, girl, girl, I ain't even told I was here because I got to go straight to the bathroom. Let's go. <laughs> No, I'm actually just I'm sitting right here waiting for her to come down. I act like I got a hot date. Maybe I should have took on a date. Maybe, by, baby, I got to work. Oh, Ooh, while I'm doing a text message and I'm typing all this to my cousin. Hi. I thought that was her. This ain't my neck of the woods, you hear me? I'm all the way in the north side. Anything for y'all? Yeah. <laughs> Here she go. What, Jennifer? Yes. Ah, I remember. Hey, y'all. <laughs> I said I could not let her leave because I said just hit me when you get here. And y'all know we've been ice thin and everything. Yeah, I was like, so, why is the weather like this? Well, happy early birthday. Thank you. I hope it's stuff you like. I just was thank like, you. I Look. can at least take her a birthday gift. Oh, thank you. You gonna you. do an unboxing. Okay. <laughs> <Here goes. laughs> Got some Sephora, some mascara. I should have needed this yesterday. <laughs> And then, okay, I see you be using this all the time. Let me know Every how time you, you go on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, I've been wanting to try this. Been wanting to try this. You get to try it. <laughs> okay, and some earrings. Do you wear earrings. I do. Okay, okay. Yeah, I got on some now. <laughs> they little, but I do. Okay, just making sure. Yeah, this was just like a impromptu trip. So. Oh, I next time you much. come back, let's plan like an itinerary. Okay. So guys, she went to um, Peyton's meet and greet last night and she got vanilla sex. I was like, can you go get it so I can smell it? <laughs> Up her bag. Y'all watch, she gonna let me open it. It's not even, oh, you sure? Yeah, you don't have yeah. to. 
Go ahead. Okay, I have that one. So what's this one right here? This this, this is this is fucking fabulous. Yeah. I had this one. I didn't. I didn't keep this one. It says. Is Who is this by? Oh, it's so mm -hmm. Yeah, I know this was a stack. Don't even tell me. <laughs> it kind of smells like cinnamon. To me. It do, and I haven't even sprayed it. Yeah. You I, like uh, cinnamon? I do. Oh, I hope so. Honey, this is a to, private blend. Mm -hmm. I used to love uh, Fireball. It's, so. I don't smell. <laughs> you don't drink anymore. Oh. I had gastric bypass surgery, so. Oh yeah. How long ago did you have it? Two years ago. That smells like nothing but cinnamon to so, me. So, I'm gonna mix that. I bet you that smells good with that thing. I don't wanna open your Open it! Girl, <laughs> girl I ain't worried about it. Let me stop playing. You know I'm childish. I got this candle. Too. What candle is it? Oh, you was up in the, yeah. Yeah, you, I spent the bag. You didn't come to play. You didn't come to play. That's what I'm talking about. I was like, Live it up. Mm. I was like, I'm gonna spend my money. It's my birthday month, why Hey, not? all month. You should have went by, um, did you go by the same room? Oh, well, you already did some damage. No, I didn't. And you that know you right by, um, Amir Oud. Really? Yeah, you like a couple of lights away. Well, it's okay. I'll be back. I met, I met somebody here, so okay. I'll be back. Okay. <laughs> you gonna mess somebody out. Okay. <laughs> not like that, not like that. Not like that. Oh. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm trying to get her no, away. I got, I got you sing? Oh, you got a girlfriend? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, never mind. I've been saying we could be in these streets together. Yeah. I mean, I can still be in the streets. But just I'm respectfully. Here by myself, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here by myself now. She at work. But yeah, I, I wouldn't. I personally would not mix, like wear it together. I mean, separately. Uh huh. Um, I would have to mix it. Which one? This one? That one. The vanilla. vanilla sex, let me see. Yeah, I would, I would mix it. Um, Did they have the other one, vanilla Patal? Is that what it's called? Girl, I don't the know. The one in the had, brown? I think so. They had a lineup of stuff. Let me see. They had a lineup. I don't think this me. You don't smell a little like... It's a lot of cleaner, Like a cleaning solution in here, like what I use to clean my tub. That's why I, I smell it like myself. I smell it mixed with everything else because I was like, look, vanilla can be sometimes for me. So I, I smell it mixed with fucking fabulous and uh, yeah, you soleil, gonna, something. You're going to have to mix that. And um, I forgot to bring them cards out here, but it was some cards mm -hmm. that they had that was a mix, uh, had like scents mixed together. Let See, when I think funny. sex, I think something that's going to be like sensual and I don't think this. If you mix it with that, yeah. <laughs> It definitely does. Alright, yeah. But Thank yeah, you, baby. You're welcome. I, uh... <laughs> I'm about to fall! <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. You like that one? Ooh, girl, what? No, girl, let me fix my hair. Then I'm gonna let you go. <laughs> no, don't rush, baby, because I'm one of them type of people who's gonna take it right till we get it right. Yeah, it's the next day. Look what just came in the mail. Another Amberie Saffron. Sugar, how many bottles we done went through? Because I told them to guess in my last perfume video and I don't even know. A lot, huh? Not more than 10, though, huh? Probably, huh? 15? 12. About 12. Yeah, I think it is 12. And this is one of their originals. Um... I don't like it though. It's the wellness connection collection. Rose and basil. Yeah, no. <laughs> That's exactly what it smelled like. So I don't know what I was thinking. Rose and basil. And I got three more diffusers. YSL Black Opium inspired. Tom Ford Lost Cherry inspired. Le Labo 33 inspired. Alright, so boom. We got 70s players ball tonight. I was gonna give them like real hoochie 70 ish, but I don't feel like we're in no shape or and all that. So, y'all remember this that I was trying to run for my birthday? Don't this material give 70 ish? So, I'm gonna go get it in my size. We're gonna put on the same thing we had on last night, Sensual Instinct, because I don't remember if it like did the thing, but child, they said it smelled like baccarat. I got a slight headache, y'all. I stayed up all night editing. I had to be up real early. But let's go exchange this. And y'all probably won't see me till I'm dressed. And this right here is um House of Dasha. So I will link it below. It's a pantsuit.
Also, I did get a mirror. I'm gonna put where that plant is at. Girl, hopefully I can just, it's the mirror like this. I can just sit it right there. We'll set it up tomorrow. Yeah, I had to stop and get some gas because I stopped last night, honey. But it was so cold and it was pumping so slow. I stopped that bitch at $5 just to get me home because uh-uh, uh-uh. It was about five degrees and it was pumping. I had been sitting in the car five minutes. It was on $2. And tonight, I ain't stopping. So, uh, let's go fill her up so I don't got to do all this when I'm dressed. Y'all, the sun's so disrespectful. Can y'all even see me? So let me show y'all what I got. I got these earrings right here. Lord, don't turn before I even get them to the house. That's them right there. Because I got some denim. Boy, don't play with me. Bell bottoms. And I'm going to tie a white shirt up. And wear them with these earrings. And one of those like leather peplum type belts. If. I get home and this outfit don't work out so this is a this is actually a large I had a 1x so I skipped over extra large and went down to large so I'm gonna go home real quick try both of them on take a shower and take a nap and get ready for tonight all right guys I really wish I would have got the size that was one up because this was 30 bucks 40 bucks I guess that's a good price and it's giving very much Walmart <laughs> It's, yeah, but I'm going to keep it. It's the one that has the stand. So, I need to get my floorboards and stuff clean. This place, this little spot over here was like covered in DJ equipment and it's stuff for years. And so, yeah, I think I like that plant bed over there, but I need this body mirror like this. So... Girl, light beat me up, shorty. Damn. Well, oh, that didn't help. What y'all think? Just keep this size. That should be good, huh? All right, guys. So I'm running a lot behind. I I can't. Oh, I can't give y'all no turn up today or nothing. Okay, sorry. Into this cafe is what I'm putting on. Girl, let me put something in my fro. Let's put a little don't be shy in her right see. We're gonna put a little don't be shy in her. I'm gonna show y'all the feet calm down. Here's the earrings, the glasses. Tie this shirt up. Put this bed on like this. These bell bottoms. Let's go. I really gotta fluff my fro. The car was hating a little bit now. Take a little bit of that off that face now. That rolls out. Who don't care? Yeah, who don't care? Yeah, I forgot to switch purses. Russia. Been knowing about this event two months. Oh well. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, where's my sister? Let's go. I need on a coat. Who the hell I think I am? Foxy Brown? It's 20 degrees out here. I don't have no jacket on. I should put that mink on, but what you gonna do when you get in here? Take it off. Where you at? Oh, okay. Where? Oh, come on, sis. You got a coat on. <laughs> well, you ain't gonna need it in here. All our cars dirty out. We've been in a snowstorm. Look at sis. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> In the building, we just gonna make us a quick appearance, yes. get us some drinks and some food. I need some shade on so I can really be cute. That's being kind of good, girl. You look good. <laughs> oh, let me get out the way for somebody to knock my hip. 
catch with the chains on. Huh? What up, nickels? <laughs> what up? It's them damn nickels <laughs> out on the scene. Outside. We outside. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. I know. My camera's so cold, it didn't want to work. Booty popping. <laughs> uh uh. Hey, y'all lit. <laughs> okay, you know I'm way over here.